Was it a harmless senior prank or a criminal act? That's what parents, students and administrators are battling over in one New Mexico school district. News 13's Ariana Kraft explains. Two weeks ago, several students from Gallup High School went inside the building in the middle of the night. They say to pull a senior prank. All it was was just like, it was just decorative streamers, decorative toilet paper, um, strings and books and stacking up the trash bins. That's it. The parents sent us these pictures, which show what many might consider a school prank, but the Gallup McKinley County School District is calling it a crime, describing what they did as breaking and entering, vandalism, and destruction of school property. My son um, did get suspended from um, Gallup High School. Parents say they don't think the suspension is fair, but in a press release, the district estimates damages at more than $30,000. Parents say the police report says differently. The well, first police report shows zero damage to the school. Nothing was damaged or broken. The police report also states no items have been identified as broken, but more as trashed. Parents say they're still waiting to hear from the district. There's this $30,000 floating out there. We want to know, we want to itemize lists of that $30,000. And with the end of the school year around the corner, students involved are at risk of losing out on scholarships. It also looks like um, their graduation is a, a question right now. So, I mean, that's the part where we, we, we've shed tears. Ariana Kraft, KRQE News 13. Parents say some of them have set up a GoFundMe account to raise money for an attorney to help get their kids back in school. We reached out to Gallup McKinley County school leaders to answer questions. We're still waiting to hear back.